Hey, my name is Taylor. I'm a product designer with the editor extension team here at GitLab. Here are some quick ideas on how we could use Duo Chat to boost the onboarding of Duo features. So idea one, let's treat it like a messaging app. So in this case, in messages, messaging apps, you often have like a bubble or a dot showing that you've got new messages. What's nice about this is it's not in the, forcing the user into a particular workflow. They can um, enter it as they ha are curious or want to take an initiative. So let's click this and you can see we start promoting. Perhaps they have now have just gotten access to Duo or it could really be any number of ups, upsells that we're providing here. But what's nice is it's engaging and it allows the user to ask follow-up questions about, hey, how do I troubleshoot pipeline errors? That's something I'm interested in to boost my workflow. They can ask questions and get immediate responses. Another idea was what if we use our notification area? So we're currently call these to-dos, but let's say we can tell someone has made commits so they're likely to be a developer persona. And so we give a personalized message suggesting that they try out GitLab Duo in their ID. User clicks it and now they perhaps get a hook of like, hey, here's something interesting about it of how this is useful to you how others have found it useful, but really what we're trying to do is figure out which IDE, IDE they're using so that we could provide um, customized advice. So let's say JetBrains, we then prompt them on how to install it, give them some quick links, and then they can go ahead and get up and running a lot faster. And so within the IDE, another way we could boost onboarding is by improving the empty state. So currently we just repurpose the same standard questions that is used in the web UI. So things like, how do I change my password in GitLab? That's not gonna be as interesting or relevant to users within the ID. So what if we could do things like, like what are dual slash commands? Or how do I include specific files to improve the responses of my dual chat questions? How do I write tests? These can be customized to anything and it could really help improve the understanding and usage of dual features that are present within the ID. And that's it for now. Thanks for watching.